Take a good luck, you two. Ooh. Ah. <gasps> Grass type Pokemon, Grookey. Fire type Pokemon, Scorch Bunny. Water type Pokemon, Swobble. Swo. Sobo? 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 It's pretty cool. Tell your own thing. One's a monkey. One's a fish thingy. The other one's a monk. The other one's a monkey. Did I say monkey? Or did I say bunny? It's like you're pretty good cutscene. Don't cry, little guy. Don't cry. <gasps> Dude, Crookie's so cute. All right then. Line up, everyone. Which one will you choose? <gasps> hmm. Go on. You pick first. I've already got my Wulu. <laughs> After all. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know what. Oh, it's like a frog thing. It's like a frog lizard looking thing. This is just a bunny. But this is a monkey. Look how cute he is. Hey, monkey. Wanna be my, I mean, Crookie. Hey, Crookie. Wanna be my friend? Oh my god, look at you! The grass type Pokemon Crookie, eh? It's soothing, like a nice long walk in the woods. Grass type Pokemon Crookie, is it? Yes, si, senor. You choose Crookie. Would you like to give Crookie a nickname? Mmm. Mmm. What can I name Grookey? What can I name him? What can I name him? I'll be right back with a name. One eternity later. Just realized why, why am I thinking so hard? My first Pokemon is always gonna be called Sorak. Come on, man! <laughs> I always named it Sorak. Sorak has been added to the party. Thank you. Hiya! Oh man, look at you! You're so cute. Oh. So adorable, man. So it'll be Grookey for you. Nice one. Then I'll go with Swobble. You're mine. I'm aiming to be the next champion. So be ready. Wait. So be ready. You and you and I'll be doing some serious training. This must not be me, right? Bet you will hop. That's why I brought along these Pokemon for you and Sully. So two of you can battle and train and grow stronger together. Try to reach me, eh? Oh, poor Scorchman. Where's he gonna go with? And you'll come with me. Charizard will show you the ropes. He's strict, but real strong and real kind, too. Yeah! That's the attitude. Alright, enough of all this trainer nonsense for one night. Dinner's ready, children. Bring along your Pokemon and let's all eat. Thank you, Mom. Oh! That guy's really excited for, um... For the food. Ah, uh, there's... Oh my god! She's so energetic. The next day... You spent the whole night with the new partner of yours, right, Hop? You two getting along alright? Understanding one another? Maybe even building up a bit of love? Of course I have, Lee. So, <laughs> Sully's made fast friends with his Grookey too. Then listen up, you trainers. Believe in yourself and your Pokemon. If you trust one another and carry on battling side by side long enough, then someday, you might even become worthy rivals for me, the undefeated champion. What you're looking at him for, Lee, I'm the one who will be coming to challenge you. If you think Soli might be able to challenge you, then I guess he's my first rival. But I'm not planning to lose to him and miss out on the chance to be the unbeated champion. Just have a Pokemon with you doesn't make you a real trainer, you know. 
Whoa, what's with that attitude, dude? Proper trainers raise their Pokemon up to be first rate in battle too. Oh, of course, dude. Everyone knows that. Oh, and you think you're worthy of calling yourself a, such a trainer already, Pop? Guess I'll be the judge of that, eh? Let's see how you handle yourself in battle against your friend if he's up for it. Oh, with me, eh? What do you say? Willing to already take on Hop for your first ever Pokemon battle of your life? Uh, yeah. Believe in your partner Pokemon. Believe in your partner Pokemon? What? Shouldn't it be believe in your Pokemon partner and take care for them too? With all your heart. Do those two things and I'm certain you'll learn to choose the moves that suit your Pokemon. And more importantly, to have a champion time battling with me. Sick! Looks like everyone's on board, Pokemon and trainers alike. Now let's do this! I've been, uh, I've watched every match that Lee's ever had. I've read every book, magazine, he's left behind at home too. I know exactly what to do in order to win! That guy's too excited, man, too excited. <laughs> Ooh, it's music, man. You're challenged by Pokemon Trainer Hop. Yes, yes, I am. Pokemon Trainer sent out Wulu. <laughs> sent out Wulu. Go, Sorak! Yeah, that's my Sorak! A Pokemon battle it is, and I've got two partners on me. Oh, I know, I know what you got. I'll scratch you. Scratch that pretty little face yours. Oh, I'm sorry, scratch that pretty little face yours. Ah, uh, my face! You hit me with that fluffy cotton. It hurts so much. Scratch that pretty little face. The opposing Wulu fainted. Goodbye, Wulu. It was nice knowing you. Plus 55 XP. Level up. Sick. <gasps> Sorex a girl. That's why she's so adorable. Sorex grew to level 6. Nice. Branch poke. I'm gonna poke you with this branch. It's not over yet. I've added just another trusty ally to our team. Pokemon trainer set Swabble. Fight. I'm uh, I'm gonna use the new move. Swabble, use pound. That was not pound. That was a headbutt. That's cheating. Poke. Oh, you dead. D E A D. Dead. Did you already know about type advantages? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I do. Critical hit. Critical hit? What kind of beginner's look is that? The opposing swabble fainted. Goodbye. I win. You're the loser. I'm the winner. Oh yeah. Your Pokemon trainer gained XP points. Plus 55. Load up again. Sick. You defeated Pokemon trainer Hop. Awesome. You beat my two Pokemon with your one. You and that Grookey are too much. Ha. Take the L. <laughs> Well, that was a shock. I guess I know why Lee thought he should give you a Pokemon too. You and your Pokemon all fought hard. Made me almost want to let out Charizard to join in in all the fun. Oh no, please don't. He'll kill us. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> Good effort out there, Gookie. Why don't I get you all sorted? What do you mean? Oh, thank you. You healed up. And Sully, you've got a real promise. In fact, I've got a fairy task here. What do you mean? Be a real rival to Hop, would you? Push him and make the both of you strong. Grr. <gasps> Whoa, that music changed. <laughs> Oops, hit my disc. You see me battle now, so come on. You've got to let me take a Pokemon gym. You? Join the Pokemon challenge? Wait, what did I say? Pokemon challenge? You think you're ready for the single greatest competition in Galar region? You think you can do it? Uh, not putting the cars before the Rapidash. What? If that's really what you want to do, you two have a whole lot to learn about Pokemon. Especially your friend Sully. Before you think about getting gym badges, best to think about getting a Pokedex. A trainer's Pokedex helps them learn a lot of things about Pokemon out there, including their strengths. Oh, interesting. But it's more than just collect a collection of data, you know. It's a record of trainers' love and passion for Pokemon trainers. Right! Right! We get it! Pokedexes then! We're on it! Looks like it's off to the Pokemon Research Lab for you and me, Soli. That's the kind of enthusiasm a, a trainer needs. 
I'll let the professor know to expect you. Thank you, thank you. I'm going to be the next Pokemon champion, so completing the simple Pokedex will be nothing. You probably better go tell your mom that we're heading out though. Oh yeah, that's true. So I heard a noise behind me and it was quite spooky. What the? Where did you come from? You were just in the house. Sully, did you hear that just now? Yeah, sounded like someone crashed. The gate opened. And the woo <laughs> And the woohoo that was there 